building right off of US 1 North. This has been your Beaver Toyota community calendar. It's exactly 8 o'clock here in St. Augustine. We hope you're having a good Friday morning. Some clouds around, a little bit of light rain in different parts of the county, and we expect to have that chance of rain off and on during the day, but nothing too significant. Dr. Calpana Di Pasquale joins me here live in the studio, and we appreciate her being here on this Friday morning. We talked about her joining us, and sure enough, it happened. It did. I'm here. How magical is that? <laughs> I know, and it's. I've been here every Friday for a Quite a while well, I know, now. and we appreciate that. We really do. So before we get into uh, what we're going to talk about today, did you have a good Thanksgiving? I did. How was yours? It was good. Did you have turkey? Uh, actually, we had ham this year. Really? Had to just change it up. Man, you did change it up. <laughs> changed it up. How do you have? How do you prepare your ham? I put it in the oven. Oh, smarty pants! And I buy pants. it from Fresh Market. <laughs> and I make it easy. Do you put like those, uh, like my grandmother used to do, the canned wedges of pineapple on it? Nope, didn't do that. Just <laughs> stuffed it in the oven and called it a day. It was great. Oh uh, well, that's good. Well, we hope you had a very good Thanksgiving. And Dr. Calpana Di Pasquale, of course, is the founder of St. Augustine Ear, Nose, and Throat, and she is a uh, board certified. Help me pronounce this. I'll tell you, genologist. <laughs> How's that? I totally screwed that up, didn't I? Yes, you did. It's otolaryngologist. Wow. And you say that 10 times. I could probably do it. You think it. you could pull yeah, that off? Maybe at least two or three without uh, getting tongue-tied. Hey, you're also the founder of Avanti Medical Spa and Avanti uh, RX Skin Care. And we're going to talk about that today. We're going to talk a little bit, too, about Botox and some other things, some cutting-edge things that are out there that don't involve you know, significant surgery that can really change your appearance, right? That is right. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so as people get ready for the holidays, how quickly can you change someone's appearance? Well, you know, the goal really isn't to change our appearance. I think mm -hmm. what we're really trying to do is turn back the clock and just look younger, more refreshed. So, you know, most of the treatments that we have out there these days don't really change people's appearance, but I would say more along the lines of enhancing or refreshing them. Right. Well, we're going to talk more about turning back the clock. We're going to see how many uh, turns the uh, Dr. Deepa Squally can pull <laughs> off. And in the meantime... We'd like you to check out the website for Avanti Med Spa, which is? It's AvantiMedSpa.net. All right. Give us that one more time. AvantiMedSpa.net. Davey Jones and the Monkees here on St. John's County's 99.5 FM and AM 1170, streaming this great music all the time online at staugustineradio.com, also via the TuneIn app on your iPhone or Droid. We encourage you to do that. You can listen to us anywhere in the world. At nine minutes past 8 o'clock, 66 degrees. Well, we're probably pretty much at our afternoon high already for the day, so uh, expect kind of strange conditions today. We could have wind gusts, according to the National Weather Service at the St. Augustine Airport, of up to 30 miles per hour today. So uh, that could mess up your hair, Dr. Deepa Oh, my Wally. goodness. I don't want that. Yeah. Marcus and I won't have to worry about that. But uh, and Bonnie's here. It's definitely going to mess up her hair. So, But other than that, we don't expect any significant problems. Uh, we'll keep an eye on the weather, though. Keep it tuned here to 99.5. Dr. Calpana Deepa Squale is with us, and we're in here talking about the work that she does through her uh, Vonti Medical Spa, which has locations over on State Road 312, just over the bridge on the island, and also in the Ponte Vedra area on US 1 North near Nice High School. And uh, you do a lot of great work there, right? You've been doing this for how long? For almost 13 years. Okay. All right. So in summary, if, you know, what are the services that, you know, that the Avanti Medical Spa provides? We provide multiple services, facials, Botox, filler, laser treatment. So that's the majority of what we provide. Okay. All right. What are some of the most popular procedures when people call, they're asking for blank? Well, probably Botox, just because it's probably the most commonly performed procedure. That's probably the biggest one. But there are definitely people um, really interested in filler these days, Fraxel. I mean, the, the consumer is getting pretty savvy. They understand that there's a lot more that can be done without a facelift. Right. Dr. D. Pasquale is with us here live this morning, and uh, we're talking about uh, all the great work that's done at the Avanti Medical Spa. And it's affordable, too. can be made very affordable for you. And we encourage you, once again, to reach out to them. We'll give you the contact information in a moment. We'll also put it up on our Facebook page at WSOS Radio. So let's talk a little bit about Botox for a minute. You know, are there some people that are just beyond hope and Botox just is not going to help them? Yes. <laughs> there are. Can we go ahead and name those people? It is St. Augustine. It's a small town. No, I'm not naming so anybody. So people could get Botox as young as blank. Well, I, you know, anybody really over 18, I don't I don't know if I really agree with that, but, yeah. you know, really you can do it over 18. Um, most people, I would say with the majority of the folks that we see are probably starting in their late 
late 20s, late 30s. That would be right. the most common time frames. So I would think um, maybe an early indication of Botox could help you is if you have like a crease across your forehead. Absolutely. So some of the people that are starting to develop a crease, it's really a nice thing to intervene a little early. Mm -hmm. Um, Actually, if you can do it before it starts to crease, it'll even be more beneficial because you don't want to get to the point where you have creases in your face that are difficult to get rid of. Right. Other parts of the face that Botox can help? Oh, yes. There's areas. Uh, the forehead is one big one. The other one is uh, the crow's feet around the eyes, mm. the 11s in between your eyebrows. Uh, you can address some areas around the lip. So um, also those um, you get that sort of uh, banding around your neck. You can right. even address that. So there are a lot of things that are you know, off-label uses of Botox that most people don't know about, but it can be utilized in those ways. You just helped me identify a problem that I've had that I didn't know I had, and now I know what it's called. The 11 in between my <laughs> eyebrows. I've never heard that, but that's exactly what it is. Yes, it's 11s. You don't want 11s wow. between your eyebrows. <laughs> no, I'm really bummed out. <laughs> well, you don't have to be. You can come in <laughs> and, and we can get fix Botox? them. Yeah, it's easy. Yeah, so that's a good question. So, and be honest with me, how, and she always is, <laughs> what's the percentage break of guys that you think, not just in your practice at Avanti Med Spa, but elsewhere, guys that get Botox? I would say that it's probably region dependent. So I bet in places like California that probably more people are doing it than maybe, you know, here in St. Augustine. But, you know, it's really changing. The bottom line is as the years go by, I see more and more men interested um, in microdermabrasion, skin care, Botox. So it's not that uncommon like it used to be maybe 10 years ago. Um, Of course, you're uh, a mom, wife, doctor, but you're a, a woman too, right? Uh, I so, hope so. <laughs> so when you look at guys, guys that get Botox, uh, does it really significantly make them look younger? It does. From a female perspective looking at a guy? It does. It does. does it? Because a lot of men have significant forehead wrinkling is where I see it start early in men and you know that can start as early as their mid-30s and as soon as you get rid of those wrinkles they look 10 years younger yeah makes a big difference well for those of us guys out there that have had teenage girls it's all understandable because we have a (laughs) permanent frown you know on our face we can get rid of that permanent frown then your daughters will think that you're always happy with them (laughs) that's right and you look like you're 25 uh botox too though it, it can be done it's a great thing it'll it'll make some significant changes for you but it has to be done on a fairly regular basis right it's not just a once in a lifetime thing no it has to be done at least every three months and you know the bottom line is if you decide you don't want to continue nothing negative is going to happen it's not like you look way worse than you ever did before if you decide to stop so some people think oh it's addictive i got to keep doing it if i don't do it i'm going to look 10 times worse. Not really the case. You'll just go back to what you looked like before the Botox. There you go. Hey, you can schedule uh, a session for Botox, obviously. It might be a nice thing to do for the holidays as you start thinking about Christmas parties and New Year's Eve parties and all that, right? Oh, yeah. It's, yeah. A, it's a busy time of year. Everybody wants to look good for these family gatherings, holiday parties, and you know, we, none of us want to look bad. That's right. Well, you can go to the website, avantimedspa.net. That's avantimedspa.net. That's spelled A-V-A-N-T-I, avantimedspa.net. You can also call to schedule a consultation. I know it's tough to jot down phone numbers when you're driving around, but... We're going to give you one anyway, just in case you might be at home. What's that phone number? It's 461-6797. What's the number again? 461-6797. So, Dr. Pasquale, are you a pretty good dancer? Can you sway to the music? Yeah, I'm, I'm not too bad. Are you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Your husband Marcus is he a pretty good dancer too? He's he's getting a lot better. So do you take the lead? Does he take the lead? Well, I don't know. We usually don't do a lot of uh, like ballroom dancing. That's Have you ever sure. done any ballroom dancing? We did actually years ago. We took some ballroom dancing lessons, and uh, neither one of us was very good at it. So right. I think it fell by the wayside. That's tough to do. You, it know, you really see is. it on TV, and you think, oh, how hard can that be? But I don't know. I'm not very coordinated. I don't think it's, I'd be very good. It's a lot harder than just kind of moving to the music. Now, if we were to look back to your grandparents in India, you know, what sort of dancing do they do in India? Oh, they do something called Bharatanatyam. Okay, and what's that? Very, it's just very, a more structured kind of dancing. Okay. Very classical. You know, I, I don't even really know how to Would it be it. like a group dance? Almost like, well, we would have a square well, dance here. They have or? some group dancing and then they have some solo dances as well. But, you know, there's specific moves that you have to do. It's not, there's not really an, anything left 
or, you know, just, you know, go with the flow right. kind of thing. It's it's very, very different. Were you taught any of that as a child? Yes, I was I was definitely forced to take lessons and, yeah. and do that as a child. So can we get you to do some of that now? We'll put it up on our YouTube yeah, channel. I'm pretty sure I don't remember anything. <laughs> I probably was about 10 when I did that the last time. <laughs> Dr. Calpana Di Pasquale is with us. And of course, she's the founder of St. Augustine Ear, Nose and Throat. She's also the founder of Avanti Medical Spa, uh, which has offices on State Road 312, as well as in the Ponte Vedra area. And we encourage you to learn more by going to avantimedspa.net. And as we get ready for the holidays and 2016 and New Year's resolutions and the like, a lot of you may say, hey, I want to you know, improve my appearance a little bit. We talked about Botox in the last break, but there are other things that people can do right? They can enhance their appearance. Absolutely. We're talking about, you know, fillers and Fraxel, you know, good skin care. Even something as minimal as a microdermabrasion or facial or a chemical peel can really do wonders to rejuvenate your skin and your appearance. So fillers, a lot of people, uh, both men and women, right, will lose fat in their face, right? Mm -hmm. And then your bones tend to be, you know, more prominent, if you will. That tends to make us look older. Yes, it does. So how do you go about filling those areas after we've lost that fat? Well, it depends which areas need to be filled, but most commonly people will start to lose volume in their cheek area. And then also the other couple of places that are very common are nasolabial folds, the area between your cheek and your mouth, and marionette lines, the area around your the lower part of your chin. So those are the most common places people will lose volume and need some enhancement. Okay. And what do you, that sounds so much better, by the way, when you say volume and I said fat. <laughs> You're so much better at language and nuance. So, uh, when we, what do you use to give people their volume? Is it is it fat or what is it? What goes into our bodies? Well, they used to use fat years ago, okay. and it's interesting because fat didn't last very long. So, you know, you put fat in there, and it was real hard. You always had to overcorrect. What's so great about the fillers these days <laughs> is you don't really have to overcorrect. You can correct to the place that you where you want it to be. And most commonly, the fillers are made out of hyaluronic acid, and there's also one made out of calcium hydroxyapatite. Okay. 25 minutes now after 8 o'clock. We're live in St. Augustine with Dr. Calpana Di Pasquale here on 99.5. We'll get back to the music here in just a second. Here's a good question, though, for you. Is it possible to make my nose look smaller without surgery? That's a, it's such a funny thing because we get asked that so often in the medical spa. Um, and no, it's not possible to make noses look smaller without surgery. I mean, really? making a nose smaller requires a rhinoplasty, <laughs> unfortunately, but we do get asked funny questions like that. So a lot of us who are listening to this music are in our 50s, 60s, 70s. And so we, we know of, you know, that was probably the most popular plastic surgery back in the 70s. It would have been made fun of on sitcoms back in the day. You know, you had a nose job, right? That's right. How often did those take place in 2015, 2016? You know, that's a good question. I don't know what the numbers are now in comparison to what it was back in the 70s. But, you know, there are definitely those people that don't want to have surgery these days. But Clearly, it's a very popular procedure. People do, you know, the people who do not like the appearance of their nose um, want to have a change. This is definitely the way to do it. Right. Okay. Do people ever, I would imagine, because you are an ear, nose, and throat specialist, do they ask you on occasion and say, hey, Dr. Diva Squally, what do you think of my nose? Yes, I do get asked that. Now, I really, I don't perform rhinoplasty right. anymore. It's not been a particular interest of mine. But the, there are a couple of funny things that people do ask me. Um, one, they'll ask me, can I make their nose look like mine? Yeah, you have a nice nose. <laughs> but it's funny because it may not really suit their face, you know. So if my nose is definitely on the small side. And if you have right. a larger person, it really would be better for them to have a nose that's more in balance with the features of their face and rather than have my tiny little nose. So right. so I've gotten asked that. And then uh, the other funny question I get asked frequently is, so when you do my septoplasty, can you just throw in a rhinoplasty with it? And <laughs> right. like, first of all, rhinoplasty takes several, another couple of hours. So no, but it's, and it's not I, like Publix. It's not a BOGO. It's not. <laughs> right. That's or, funny. or sometimes they ask me, can, can we just throw that in under the insurance? I'm right. Like, yeah, that's fraud. <laughs> no, we're not doing that. <laughs> now I have a good friend, uh, lives out on County Road 210 and he's in his mid sixties. He's always been very self-conscious of when he was in the Marines years ago in Vietnam, he got into a bar fight and he had his nose broken. And mm -hmm. it and it obviously was not reset properly. Okay. okay, so I think it served him well in life, looking like a tough guy, you know. But he's <laughs> obviously true. been very self conscious about it. Uh, can those sorts of things be repaired? 
They can. They can. So if you break your nose, um, like you said, your your friend got it reset. If you break it within the first two weeks, you can just sort of pop that bone back into place, put a little, you know, put a little uh, cast over it and, you know, allow it to heal. Yeah. Those usually, depending on the severity of the break, can heal pretty well. But... If it's been longer than two weeks, which in his case it obviously has yeah, been, you really need a, you need a rhinoplasty. At that point, the bones need to be rebroken, reset, and shaped to the desired configuration. Okay. All right. Good stuff. Dr. Calpana Di Pasquale is with us here live this morning, and we're talking about some different things you can do to enhance your appearance. That's what they do at Avanti Med Spa right here in St. John's County with two locations. AvantiMedSpa.net is the website we'd like you to go to. We'll put it on our Facebook page at WSOS Radio as well. AvantiMedSpa.net. You can also call to schedule a consultation, and that won't cost you anything. 461-6797. That telephone number again, 461-6797. We'll be right back with Dr. Deep Esquale. Arthur Conley here from the 1960s on 99.5. Hope you're having a good morning. 27 minutes now before 9 o'clock. Dr. Calpana Di Pasquale is with us here live this morning. She joins us on Friday mornings, and we appreciate her taking time out of her busy schedule to do that. And, of course, she is the founder and medical doctor, of course, at St. Augustine, ear, nose, and throat, with offices over on the island on the other side of the 312 Bridge, and also in the Ponte Vedra Nice High School area off of US-1. You can learn more by going to S-A-E-N-T. Dot net. But this morning we're talking about her work with Avanti Med Spa, which she founded over a decade ago, right? That's right. Yeah, and lots of things that you can do to enhance people's appearance. And I know with Dr. Di Pasquale, you know, your focus is on being, you know, realistic with folks, right? There's some great things that can be done, but let's be realistic, right? I, I totally agree. And that's really my big focus with people. So if you're you know, 65 years old and you want to look like some 25-year-old volleyball player at St. Augustine Beach, you know, <laughs> that's probably not realistic. No, and that not really my ideal candidate. I mean, I'm really looking for those people who have realistic expectations, want to look 10 years younger. That's realistic, you know, yeah. but 40 years younger, not, not so much. Right. A lot of these things that we've talked about, Botox and fillers, and we're going to get into talking about what lasers can do. These are some amazing cutting edge, you know, 2015 kinds of products. Uh, a lot of people may be listening and saying, well, that's wonderful, Dr. DePasquale, um, but can I afford those? And number one, will my insurance pay for any of these things? And that's a very common question we get asked. Uh, unfortunately, insurance does not pay for cosmetic and elective type of procedures. But, you know, these procedures are pretty affordable these days, much more than people would think. Um, we also have uh, payment plans like care credit and whatnot. So, you know, it's a lot more affordable than one may think. It's just something that you want to come in and at least find out what you need. And then, you know, we can always discuss payment plans from there. Right. And there is some great ways to afford this through care credit and mm-hmm. you know there's all sorts of options out there so some people it, some people say they just want to send me their paycheck i'm like okay no, <laughs> <just kidding. laughs> well it is affordable and a lot of folks in st john's county and greater st augustine have taken advantage of this we want you to check out the website of course avanti medspa.net that's avanti medspa.net we'll put a link to uh that website up on our facebook page at wsos radio we encourage you to check that out at 25 minutes now before 9 o'clock, live here in St. Augustine, a high today of 68 degrees, and currently outside it's already 64 degrees, cloudy conditions, and we have a chance of rain. Lots of wind today with wind gusts of up to 30 miles per hour during the day today, so be mindful of that. So, Dr. Di Pasquale, let's talk a little bit about some common maybe misconceptions, things that people have stated online about some of the products and services that you provide at Avanti Med Spa or, you know, at any med spa, mm-hmm. um, including some questions like, so is Botox the same thing as botulism, right? Because it's B-O, it's ba, right? And we know it's poison, <laughs> right? So is it the same thing that could cause locked jaw and things like that? It absolutely is. Is it really? <laughs> it is. It's, it's all about quantity, thing. right? It's all about quantity, exactly. I mean, if you put a large enough dose in, which, you know, is very unlikely for the amount that we use for, you know, wrinkles and all. And also Botox is used for, um, in neurology, also for headaches, migraines, and, you know, neck spasms and things like that. And obviously in those cases, they're using larger doses. And even then, it's not causing the lockjaw issue. Right. Well, I guess, as you know, better than any of us as a medical doctor, there's lots of things that might make us cringe that you use in medicine to bring out a much more positive result, right? Exactly. You know, one of the funniest things that I that always makes me kind of cringe is uh, the use of leeches. 
Yeah. I mean, leeches that are was a actually, big thing. yeah. I mean, they're actually very useful. So, it, but it still makes me cringe, even though they're useful. <laughs> so, leeches, uh, will they like clean out an infection or something like that? Well, if you have, and it's often where I remember seeing this was in, you know, when I did all these big head and neck cases in residency. Mm-hmm. And if you had a, a flap that you, you know, for reconstruction of a big head and neck cancer defect, it would, it can pool with blood, with venous blood. So, the leeches not only allow that blood to, they suck out that blood and, and restore the vascular flow of that flap right so kind of interesting and uh, they, they been, give you an itchy feeling yeah i mean i i think i've only seen it once or twice but yeah it just really <laughs> it was that's a like, hard one <laughs> that's like going back in time too right exactly uh well, so here's some other things that people have said uh we were talking a little bit earlier about uh, dermal fillers for example things that can help bring back the fullness in your face which will make you look younger if somebody were to buy a dermal filler in mexico you know, where it's probably a little less expensive and completely unregulated, can they just stop by your office and you'll just go ahead and shoot them up with it, right? (laughs) Absolutely not. But we have been asked that question before. (laughs) Really? It's just so important to know the product you're getting and, you know, buy it from an appropriate vendor. (laughs) So, you know, all our products are only bought from the appropriate vendor. We buy Botox straight from Allergan. We also use a product called Xeomin, which I like very much, and that's from MERS. So, you know, you really want to get the right product from the right people, not on eBay. Yeah, what what could possibly go wrong with buying some Botox in Juarez, Mexico and transporting <laughs> yeah. it across international lines and asking you to put it in their body? Yeah, nothing, nothing. Yeah, wow, it real sounds safe. Sounds perfectly reasonable to me. Oh, man. So there's a TV show that's pretty popular out there in the sort of reality TV show world about called Botched, you know, where people have had various, uh, you know, plastic surgery procedures done and they've been, well, botched. <laughs> have you ever seen that, I mean, have patients come to you either in your practice with Avanti Med Spa or at St. Augustine Ear, Nose, and Throat where obviously some plastic surgeon or cosmetic surgeon somewhere, uh, you know, really botched it up? We have, I mean, probably not to the severity that they're seeing on the show, but I've certainly had people come from other doctors that, you know, their filler was injected, you know, unevenly. They weren't happy with the result. Botox was injected in places that caused a undesirable look. So I've definitely had to fix things that other doctors have performed. Right. Hey, one thing too, before we totally leave the topic of fillers and Botox and all that, and we talked earlier about how to maintain the look that Botox will give you, that younger appearance, you need to maintain it ideally every three months, right? Mm-hmm. If you were to completely stop for whatever reason, financial reasons, or you just didn't want to do it anymore, does that mean that you're going to suddenly look like a Sharpay or something like that? I mean, everything's just going <laughs> to go to heck in a handbasket. No, it's oh, not. Okay. But, you know, it's funny. I think that the people who are used to seeing themselves without those wrinkles, they may feel like it. I've had emergent texts from people saying, oh, my God, my Botox wore off. <laughs> so, I mean, granted, you don't go back looking worse than you did. But just even going to back to that pre-Botox appearance may be a little startling, but definitely not worse than you started off with. See, that would be an entertaining day for me at the uh, front desk at Avanti Med Spa or St. Augustine, your nose and throat, but to get to just get the emergency call that I need, <laughs> an emergency Botox call. It happens. Does it really? It happens. Yes, See, it we does. need names. We've got to put those people out there. <laughs> that's funny. Dr. Calpana Di Pasquale is with us here live this morning. We're talking about all the great work that's done at Avanti Med Spa right here in St. John's County with two locations. Please go to the website. Check out AvantiMedSpa.net, AvantiMedSpa.net. You're going to learn about all these cutting-edge procedures and also ways uh, to pay for all that because it is very, very affordable. So stay tuned. We're going to be back with Dr. Deepa Squally in just a moment. Billy Ocean here on 99.5 WSOS. Good Friday morning, TGIF Friday, as we head toward Christmas at light speed. And speaking of that, you know, there's some holiday options, right? If you want to get somebody a gift, you know, you could uh, do that at Avanti Med Spa, right? Yes, you can. We're actually having a 20% off special starting next uh, Monday, December 7th, going on till the 23rd, where you can get gift certificates for the people that you don't know what to get them, or facial's always nice. I uh, can get gift certificates for Botox, filler, um, my microdermabrasions product, whatever. So it's a good deal. So that would be my sense. And of course, uh, you're the female expert here. But if a guy that's listening to us now were it to get their wife, spouse, girlfriend or whatever, a gift card, that, mm-hmm. that in no way is going to be interpreted as us saying anything negative about them, right? 
I wouldn't think so, especially if you put it as, hey, uh, you should treat yourself to a facial or something That's like that. That's the key word. You know, then it's just a pampering thing. You deserve some some time to yourself. But no, you don't want to say, hey, you need some Botox. That's Thank you. That's not a good idea. See, sometimes we need guidance on language. Yes. You know, it is all about language. The intent can be the same, but we just need guidance on language. Because where you said that term, honey, I want you to treat yourself. That's right. Boy, that is good, isn't it? <laughs> That is really good. That's the way it needs to be done. Well, anyway, that's the way to get a gift card. And, of course, you can do that. You can stop by your offices, I would imagine. Yes, in the office we have them available. Okay, and, of course, the office locations are just over the 312 Bridge, of course, uh, on Plantation Island Drive and uh, also uh, up near Nice High School, just on US 1 North. And we'll give you all that information. The best way to connect that way is to go to avantimedspa.net, avantimedspa.net. And to take advantage of that 20% deal, which takes uh, is a limited time offer, right? Yes, it's for about two weeks. So December uh, 7th to the 23rd. Right. Let's talk a little bit, too, about age spots, because a lot of our listeners, given the age of the music that we're playing, have, quote, age spots. First, tell me what they are. Age spots are just dark areas on your face. They can be on your neck, your decollete area, and your hands. Those are the most common places. Yeah. And they're just dark spots, usually things we want to cover or get rid of. And Dr. D. Pasquale, they're made more prominent, I guess, because we live in the Sunshine State. Exactly. Sun exposure. And also some of it is also genetics. I mean, if your parents had a lot of them, it's likely that you will. So Avanti obviously has uh, some products that can take care of that. How, how would you go about treating age spots? So it depends on how bad they are. But, you know, for people who are just w- looking to get a good start on it, we have a great product called Age Spot Remedy. It doesn't have hydroquinone, which is found in so many products that tend to lighten the age spot. So it's all botanicals. It will nat- naturally lighten your skin, and it works very effectively. So if somebody was not really into getting a big laser treatment to remove age spots, Age Spot Remedy would be a great place to start. So talk to us. Uh, that's a natural lead into laser treatments, okay? Because we hear about lasers, whether you go to the veterinarian, they can use lasers on your dog. We can use lasers for this, that, and the other. What kind of lasers do you use uh, at Avanti Med Spa, and what do they do, and what can they do for people? At, at Avanti, we have a laser called the Fraxel laser, and it has two different treatment modes. One is for the age spots that we were just discussing, and the other is for wrinkling. So that's a little deeper of a setting where we can get down underneath that wrinkle and allow that collagen to build up. What's great is we can see an immediate improvement, but over time, over the next several months, you start to see even a greater improvement. So what's actually, you know, if you can give us kind of the uh, eighth grade, you know, anatomy class explanation, what's going on when a laser hits an age spot? What, how's it fixing that problem? So that treatment is a more superficial treatment where we're looking to resurface the skin. Mm. So in those treatments, what happens is that the laser is set to a more superficial setting. So you're going, you're really going after not only the age spots, the fine lines and things like that to resurface the skin. Um, what happens after the treatment, people get red and after a few days, you start to almost have a dark, the age spots actually appear darker before they slough off. And mm. then at that point, you'll see the nice fresh skin underneath the surface. So in effect, as a uh, amateur layman here, is the laser killing the age spot? No, it's really bringing them more to the surface. I think that's the uh, okay. easiest way to explain it for the late person. Yeah, well, I'm a boy, so we want to th- we want to think of lasers zapping things and n- knocking them out. <laughs> that's the simple explanation. That would make sense. Star Wars explanation, that's, right? Yeah. That's the Star Wars explanation for a razor. laser. <laughs> So is the uh, is your family going to go to see Star Wars? Over I, the I holidays? think we're going to have to, you know, yeah. because a uh, family full out? of boys. Going to camp out at the uh, IMAX at World Golf Village? Probably not. Now's Hopefully. the time to set up the tent. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't think we're going to do that. Or they can. I'm not going to. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Calpano de Pasquale is with us live here. And, of course, if you'd like to learn more, especially about this 20% offer, we encourage you to reach out to Avanti Med Spa with two locations here in St. John's County. Go to avantimedspa.net. That's avantimedspa.net. <laughs> The great Brenda Lee and a Christmas song for you. We do about one of those an hour as we get ready for uh, Santa to arrive. Not too long from now. It is about uh, three minutes now before nine o'clock as we wrap up our time this morning live with Dr. Calvana Deepa Squally. And of course, 
She is with Avanti Med Spa and, of course, the founder and medical doctor with St. Augustine Ear, Nose, and Throat with two locations here in St. John's County. Learn more by going to AvantiMedSpa.net. That's AvantiMedSpa.net. And before we let you go, I think, too, I was kind of going down that road, Dr. DePasquale, of talking about, you know, a sense, especially with women, that, you know, it is okay to change your appearance. It's actually okay to look younger, right? It is. I mean, the bottom line is if it's something that you want and you want for yourself, I don't really think it's anybody's job or right to judge what you want to do with yourself. Right. Absolutely. One of the things, too, women... Um, you know, so often are the caregivers, you know, the, for often, you know, years they take care of the kids primarily or they're in the lead in many cases. And then they end up maybe having to take care of their aging parents or other relatives. And more often than not, they sort of put themselves repeatedly on the back burner. And indeed, the way to help that, if you see that going on around you, you, you care for a particular woman, you can actually help them get some of these services that you're offering where they can take care of themselves for a change instead of worrying about others. I totally agree. And, you know, if they have a gift certificate, then they feel differently. They didn't have to go purchase something. It was given to them. It's a gift. And then they feel, wow, well, I really need to utilize this gift certificate. I can take an hour out of my day and have a nice facial and just rejuvenate myself. And they just so enjoy that, that hour of being pampered and taken care of when they're the ones always doing the caregiving. I think what's so amazing, too, about the, uh, the, you know, the services that you provide, whether it's Botox or, you know, fillers and laser treatments and all these things that will enhance someone's appearance in a way that they want it to be enhanced, is that feeling of self-confidence that they get, not just when they walk out of your office, but I would think that's something that lasts for quite a while. It really does. And, you know, these days people are going through so many changes in their lives, whether it's a life change, a job change, or, you know, divorce, a uh, new job. I mean, everything changes in life. And I feel people, when they when they get some of these things done, they just feel so much more confident, ready mm-hmm. to tackle whatever new challenge lies ahead of them. That's a great way to put it. I mean, really, this would be the gift of self-confidence. Uh, that you could really help with people. And we encourage you once again to do that. You have a unique opportunity, a 20% off special at Avanti Med Spa. And you can take advantage of that once again by going to the website and learning more and scheduling a consultation. AvantiMedSpa.net with locations, two locations here in Greater St. Augustine and near Ponte Vedra as well. AvantiMedSpa.net. We'll put a link to that up on our Facebook page here in just a moment at WSOS Radio. So feel free to go on Facebook and uh, access that information. You can always call to 461-6797. That telephone number again, 904-461-6797 to learn more about Botox and fillers and what you can do in terms of holiday gift giving around Avanti Med Spa. Dr. Deepa Squally, have a great weekend and thank you for being with us. Thank you so much, Kevin.